Cooper Matchett here. First of all, let me say I'm feeling really badly for all the people who were in the path of Hurricane Ida. That was just absolutely horrific. Fortunately, we were not impacted, but I feel so bad for all the people who were and still are being impacted. Their lives are turned upside down. We're thinking of you. We had a fairly good holiday weekend. Earl the Squirrel was here from Burlington to usher Matilda and Nelson, Susie the Squirrel's cousins, from England around. Earl now insists on calling them the Royals. <laughs> he rolls out the red carpet whenever they embark or disembark the drone. <laughs> Luckily, it was a gorgeous day yesterday, and Earl took, took them and Susie to the southern part of Vermont to see the sights. On Saturday night, they circled around the Champlain Valley Fair in Essex, Vermont, which is a yearly fair that everybody, that a lot of people go to. Both Matilda and Nelson are loving it here, and Susie is having so much fun with them. I'm pleased for Susie because I think she works too hard in trying to get her nursing degree, not to mention trying to keep track of Lester and Chester and Mo. She really deserves a break. There have been a few communication problems since the squirrels from the UK use different words sometimes than American squirrels do, but it's not a problem. I can understand them perfectly, but you may remember I am fluent in both cardinal and blue jay languages now, so I have an ear for these things. <laughs> Susie's brothers, Chester and Lester, are busy working on a new project which I am informed is top secret at the moment. Ollie, my friend who is a rabbit and wears glasses and his gorgeous fiance Petunia, were here on Sunday for the races, but it turned really cool yesterday, so Petunia had on a gorgeous brocade jacket and beret, and she looked lovely. All the others were a little more energized because it was cooler, and just last week they were all melting on the pavement. <laughs> but fall is sure to come to Vermont and we will be here soon. That's okay, though, because my mom has promised to take me for rides looking at the beautiful foliage. That is colored leaves on trees, for those of you who don't know. Matilda and Nelson will be here to see the beautiful leaves as well. We really miss having Maddie here with us. My mom told me a story about how Maddie loved Alvin and the Chipmunk movies, and when she was younger, she used to sit and watch them just like a little kid. It was so funny. I wish I could have seen that. I'm doing my best to keep my mom busy. Just the other day, I was helping her in her office. One of my favorite things to do is to tip over her recycling basket in her office and all the papers go falling all over the floor. She will also crumble the paper into balls and throw them, and I chase them all over and bat them around the house. Do you know what my absolute favorite thing to do with these paper balls is? After chasing them around, I put them in my water dish. They float for a while, but then without warning or explanation, they get all soggy, at which time my mom usually retrieves them. But no worries, I've got more. There always seems to be more. I hope you all had a good weekend, and I hope you're all staying safe. Cougar Marcher here. Ciao.